Here's a really cool thing. I was just stopped by these two lovely ladies here at Vision Expo East, and turns out they are new members of Spexy, which is pretty rad. I love it. And I'm actually going to ask them the same question I've been asking everybody else this whole time. What is one thing that people in this industry do that just makes you, it makes you just like want to strangle? The one thing that drives me nuts is when we use our shop talk and our technical terms with patients because we turn them off and they don't get it and then they tune out. Yes. Yes. So we've been <laughs> using your videos with our staff to yes. remind them to uh, use layman's terms, make it easy to understand. It's like a little plug. I did not tell her to say that, I swear. <laughs> I swear, but it's so true. We yes. start having this laundry list of all the great things, of all the technical terms. Like okay. AR, yes. things like that, yes. poly. Yes. Don't say it. No, patients don't give a poop. No. They don't give a poop. <laughs> not one poop. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, it's exactly right. And, and like, you know, we get so caught up because that's what we're taught. Right, and we're taught, you know, from our reps and everything else, which is not a bad thing because they're teaching us the technicality because we need to know those things sometimes, right? From, from, you know, for the engineers that come in, you know, that they want to know the technical things, they want to know the Abbey value of something, or they want to know the amount of light transmission in AR. But patients don't give a crap, not one crap, <laughs> right? And right. so it's really great to be able to talk to a patient instead of talking about all that whole laundry list of all the great things with to do with anti-reflective treatment. To then go around and go, okay, what helps you look better, feel better, and see better? And the patient goes, yeah, I want that. Yes. Right? It's terms they understand. I love that. Yes. You're the best. <laughs> She's so cool. Okay, so I got another question. What is one thing that happens in this industry that just makes you want to, like, strangle? Um, I think a lot of times just people coming in and not really having a lot of knowledge and not really giving us an opportunity to educate them. Coming in and just saying, I want my prescription, I'm going to go on Zenny or the other ones. Yes. We don't need to mention <laughs> by name. Um, yes. And not really giving us an opportunity to show just what we have to offer. And I think a lot of people would be surprised that they actually can get something really great, great product and be able to see with them and really not break the bank for it. Right, right. Okay, so I'm going to follow it up with what are y'all doing about it? Well, we flip it around. I mean, thank you to Spexy for letting us know. We start to try to control the the conversation yes. by asking questions and saying, well, but why? I, love this. I mean, what I mean, so what what makes you think that and where are you getting this information from? And I would really love to just have the opportunity to kind of let you know what we're all about and what we could do for you. Yes. And that's so powerful in, in flipping things around and asking questions mm -hmm. because sometimes it's just as simple as you know, the online, the online thing was just convenient. Like it just popped up. Sure. Because, you know, somehow they know, somehow, they know <laughs> that, or their phone knows that, you know, they scheduled an eye exam, right? And so now they're getting all these ads from these other people and it was just easy. Not realizing that, you know, they're missing out on like a local opportunity. And and in all of that, what I love is that, I, I feel like our industry is making a shift because we went, you know, online optical so quickly right uh, that our industry is making a shift to coming back to seeing the real value yes. of what a great optician can do for you Absolutely. like you can have the, and here's the thing that drives me crazy and you may have heard me give this spiel virtually um, <laughs> but the thing that drives me absolutely crazy is when we have we have an industry where you can have the best doctor in the world giving the best prescription and like flipping those senses like crazy finding the best you know diagnosis for anything going on in the eye but if they don't get a good pair of glasses they're never going to be able to witness the amazing prescription that we got absolutely not not at all and so if they so the flip side of that is you know we used to fear, you know, them leaving and not getting glasses at all, but them leaving and getting a poor set fitting set of glasses or a poor fitting set of lenses yes. and not being able to experience everything that we gave them, right? So yes. I love this. You did such a beautiful <laughs> job. Thank Good you. Good job. I'm so glad you guys stopped. This is so fabulous. <laughs>